Let me guess. This is your first time in a medical trial, right? <laughs> Do I look scared? <laughs> no, not scared, just nervous. <laughs> I always look nervous. I went to law school, they teach you to look nervous in the first term, eh? Yeah? Nah, not really. Sorry, when I'm scared I tell bad jokes. <laughs> I say you are scared. A little. There's nothing to be worried about. This is my fourth time here. Yeah? Sam Fletcher, pleased to meet you. Jez Bishop. So, have they explained the rules to you yet? Yeah, but kind of went in one year and, you know. <laughs> nah, always does the first time. No, it's simple. You follow the rules, you get through the trial really easily. They get their research, you get the money. I'm not doing just for the money, but... Sure you aren't. Well, that's not the point. Look, the point is, if you follow the rules, you stay safe and enter into the spirit of the whole thing, you can come back any time you want. If you're a bad boy, that might ruin your chances of ever doing this again. I get it. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it stands to reason, doesn't it? They want good volunteers, so be good and you can come back. All right, stands to reason. Also, they can fine you if you break the rules. Like, for instance, if you get caught bringing food in from outside or if you use your phone in a restricted area, they can fine you. Also, they can ban you. Like, for instance, if you're disrespectful to staff or if you're caught drinking or smoking or if you download porn <laughs> <laughs> or if you sneak outside when you're supposed to be inside. It all costs in the end. I don't intend to do any of those things. <laughs> ah, well, then you'll be fine. I mean, you'll be okay. <laughs> We had to comply with all the trial guidelines or we compromise the drug that's been tested. Now you're starting to sound like a lawyer. <laughs> and not a nervous one either. <laughs> Sorry, been well trained, huh? Eh? Oh, well you'll be okay then.